This video is in three parts and supports a blog post I'm writing on 360 video. More importantly, what's going on when you try and watch a 360 video. So in a slide I've made here, and this is my um, dilemma and my frustration with it all, is that if I watch the, uh, which is very good actually, the Meerkat um, Zoological Society of London's 360, what I'm actually doing is only ever dragging around the middle part which is the yellow part so in other words all of this around the outside I can't actually see unless I drag it around so the visible area is inside the uh, yellow rectangle and I put some some data on the bottom here which I can um, go into more depth on my blog post now looking at the two examples the first example is if you search YouTube for 360 video, we've got this brilliant little video which is about the Blue Angels in 360 uh, by USA Today. Now here's the thing, I can watch the video, and by the way if I play any video like this, then it gets very noisy, Hi, my name is, uh, Captain stop Tom it, Frost, it gets noisy in here and you can't hear my voice, so let me just pause it. So what we can do is we can look at the video by dragging around horizontally and we've got a limit and I'll show you exactly what I mean is if I use the uh, menu at the top left and I go up I can go up and then I hit this area where I can't go any further if I go down I can't go any further now this is the third part of this video where I will be using a GOM player which has got a 360 button. This is free on the internet, it's called GOM Player. So if I hit 360 button, watch what happens. I get a playback 360 menu pop-up which is exactly the same YouTube menu but it's embedded into the player. Top of the list is the Blue Angels again, so let's click it and I think this is a beta product that's just come out and we just uh, pause it and get it resized for you so you can actually see it in the window. Um, so on the right hand side we can see once again there is the, and I'll just, just drag it around, look, there we go, we're going up with the pilots and if I go all the way to the top, look, look what happens is I can go over but I get to that bit where I stopped at YouTube but I can actually keep going and now I've actually got it upside down so it's pretty interesting in that I've got full not only 360 horizontal dragging but I've also got vertical dragging and um, in other words up and down dragging as well but this is the exciting part that I want to show and that is what YouTube does not have are the on the right hand side here the four thumbnails which show forward left right and behind or reverse view so so the brilliant thing about this is that if you play it Hi, my name is uh, Captain just Tom Frost. It I'm painting Right, so, so right now I've just paused it and the reason I pause it is because I can't talk to you and, and um, play it at the same time. So in other words, look, what's happening is that we can clearly see that we've got the chaps, uh, the pilot's yellow helmet here and we can see some other planes at the top here. But if you look to the left hand side you can actually see what could be interesting as a preview of left, right and behind you. So that's the behind view, there is the left view and there is the right view which is pretty cool so just to demonstrate that to make sure it's true and then I'll finish this video because we're already four minutes long is there is the view straight ahead if I go to the left just to prove it yeah there it is look there's a the second thumbnail there is the right one and of course behind is behind so that was using the GOM player for 360 which for me takes out a little bit of a frustration because I've got four thumb thumbnails on the right that give me preview panes.